from cafes in Valletta to farm to table experiences to fine dining. In the world of cuisine, Malta has it all. What's great about working with U.S. Tour Operator Association members is the insider's access that we provide as tour operators. Meeting with someone like Anthony at his winery, the pioneer of wine tourism here in Gozo. You read wine? And he'll really provide you that insider access to tell you about the native grapes and how he started his business here and you'll touch and feel the experience. It's the Mediterranean philosophy, the Mediterranean diet. Um, we're very fond of our foods, we're very fond of our drinks, right. um, wine, um, of course, it, it was the invention from the Mediterranean people. <laughs> Looking for local experiences, the real deal, rather than give you something that's going to give you an overview of the island, we take you inside. can come to learn about the art of cheese they can, making. They can uh, come here and, and uh, I can explain how they do the cheese from, from the farm. Traditional. Traditional, the very traditional way. So it's paradise. Huh? It's paradise. It's paradise. Uh, we grow our own vegetables in my father's estate and we bring them over here. It's a farm-to-table concept and we cook traditional Maltese rural food. Traditional Maltese food is something hearty, um, with full of vegetables, sauce, some nice meat. What's great about this experience is that all of these products are grown right on the farm, right outside. We can accommodate different types of eating, vegetarian, yes, vegetarian vegan, vegan, celiac, excellent. I think we're blessed by the, by the fact that we, we draw from very various different culinary cultures. We were an island that was um, occupied for hundreds of years, but we have produce that is kissed by the sun you know, naturally grown. Our farmers have a passion for, um, for what, they, what they produce and we work very closely with them. And when people go away, they've taken a taste of Malta.